Hey guys, what's happening? Back again. Um, I'm gonna do another vlog tonight. Tonight I'm going to London to see uh, a show at um, Rum Runners. I'm gonna bring you guys along, see uh, see who we can run into tonight, and then um, I'll catch some videos of the uh, the bands. And then other shit going on, I don't know. We'll see where it goes, you know, I always have these random things popping off in my, my vlog, so. Hopefully, try and get something to eat. I'm thinking Burrito Boys. Um, shout out to Nick Pegg for always throwing his, uh, his uh, Burrito Boy stuff happening in his vlogs, and uh, pff, I might as well join the, join the bandwagon. But yeah, I'm actually feeling a burrito. Um, trying to stay healthy. Burritos are healthy, okay? Certain circumstances, they're healthy. My circumstance can be healthy tonight, so get one of those. Um, I might meet up with some people before, the, just before the show, and then go to the show, and uh, I'll see you guys in London. Yo, what's up, guys? Um, just getting into uh, Strathroy area, so it's like really close to London. So tonight I'm going to see a show at Rum Runners, which is uh, the smaller side of um, the London Music Hall. It's in like the core of downtown uh, London. Um, there's four bands playing tonight. One are my really good friends in Safe Haven. They always kill it. Um, they're from London, us and Amnesty. We uh, did a run with them a couple months ago. Well, four or five months ago, I don't know. We ran up to, went all the way up to Ottawa. It was a, an amazing time. I wish I could go back. That was such a great time. Then next is a band from Toronto called Conversation. I've literally never heard of them or never heard them. Um, so that's new in store, a new band. I'm not mad about seeing that. The last show for one of my like favorite Ontario bands, uh, Profits, it's their last show in London. They're having a couple other shows, like they're doing a run with uh, another um, band, uh, Kennedy, they're from Quebec. Um, so they're doing a couple runs with this, a little run with them before they uh, call it quits. Um, so that's gonna be kind of bittersweet. This might be the last show. I might go to their Hamilton show, their very last show, Profits, because they're from Hamilton. But I haven't decided yet because I don't know what I have going on. I literally actually like have t lyrics of their one of their songs tattooed. It was my first tattoo, and. Uh, they still mean the exact same to me as they did when I got it, so those guys have, uh, pretty dope guys. Uh, first I was fan, like a fan of their band, now like, I'm like friends with them. It's kind of weird, I don't know, like we did a couple, we played a couple days with them, like Amnesty has. Uh, we played with them in Michigan and in Peterborough and in, in Sarnia as well. Um, so they're, they're pretty good friend of ours and mine, so I'm excited to see those guys again. And then the headliners being as an ocean, they were huge, like huge, as soon as they came out, like in 2011, I think it was, or 12. Um, what the fuck is this? Is that a detour? What the fuck? Road closed. Okay. Uh, okay, I've got to go a new route. Hopefully, I can get around this. This detour better actually take me where the fucking detour is. But back to, I'll, I'm sure I'll, I'll figure it out, but back to uh, the being as notion, yeah. He did like a front flip off the stage, laying on his back, and pretended to get knocked out, and everyone's like, holy fuck, and then he just went into the, oh, and just went back into the song. It was dope. Yeah, these guys are really good. They're really good live. I haven't been that big of a fan of their new releases. Like, their first album was, uh, like, untouchable. Like, Dear God was amazing. And then their second album was pretty good. Like it didn't live up to the standards in my pers the personal opinion because they're trying to expand their horizons, I guess, musically. The next, I think they've only released another album after that and I didn't like it really. And then they released a new single late, like not too long ago and it was not that good in my opinion. But hey, they're amazing live. I'm not gonna take any credit away from them. They're really talented musicians. Yeah, I'm supposed to, I wanna go get some food before. Um, I don't know how long this detour is gonna take me. I hope it doesn't take me off the fucking map. Because if I just followed that road, it would take me right into London. I don't know where this is taking me. Like, I'm in, like, some place called Cold Steam or Cold Stream. Like, some little fucking, like, I'll show you guys. Like, it's like the boonies. Looking ass. Look at, look at that. 
Airbud hometown looking ass. Like, <laughs> I don't fucking know. Like, oh shit. So, we'll see. Uh, we'll see how this venture goes. If this vlog, like, if you see this, you mean, it, you know, I made it. Like, if you see, like, that I get to London, I, you know, I made it. So, I'll see you guys in when I get into London. What's up, guys? I actually made it here. The detour. Yeah, it was just like a five minute detour. It wasn't that bad. Um, so I'm in London now, as you can see. Typical London looking ass. And I was gonna get burritos, burrito boys, but I drove by and there was no parking. Like I'm not paying for parking just to fucking go get a burrito and then come back in. So I might, I don't think I'll be open when I'm done, but I'll do, I'll try and see what's up. Other than that, I might have to go like, there's a Mr. Sub across from Rim Runners. I might have to go over there during one of the breaks, but um, right now I'm going to get my ticket from uh, Brody, who's the vocalist of Safe Haven. Uh, so yeah, gotta go pick up the ticket from the homie and uh, see who else is here. It's just turned like seven o'clock, so doors are open. I don't know when they go, I'm assuming they go on like 7.30, 7.45, so. Go run and do that real quick and I'll uh, see you guys in a bit. This one's for Ryan Barry. What's up guys, just got done the show. I didn't really vlog much during the show. Kinda kinda regret that a little bit, but all the boys came out, you know, all the London boys came out, but it was a good show. Safe Haven killed it. Conversation band is pretty pretty unique. I don't know. I don't know if I'd listen to them, but they kinda remind me of like Chiodos. If you guys have listened to Chiodos before. Like early early metalcore kind of stuff, I don't really know what it was. And then Profits was their last show in London, that was sick. Great band, great people. Always a good time. Oh yeah, being as an ocean, obviously. They just finished. They did a lot of new stuff, but they did also did like some older stuff, um, which was sick because they did uh, the hardest part. If you don't know the hardest part and like you're like listening to metalcore, then I don't know what you're doing. So, but I'm just heading to the car now. I might grab some food. I don't think Burritos Boys is out open anymore. It closes at like 11. It's like 11, so I'm screwed on that. So I might. Fuck, I don't wanna get the fast food. I don't wanna get I don't wanna get like some shitty burger food. Fuck. I'll have to get like something healthy. I'm just not feeling greasy food tonight. And I don't wanna wait till I get home. So I'll see you guys uh when I get home. Yo, what's up guys? Uh, gonna be a little quiet. It's like twelve fifty. I uh got subway for um the post concert meal and then drove home so took me just over like a little bit over an hour i'll see you guys in the next video and uh you know what to do already hit that subscribe button and don't worry tomorrow is gonna be a better day just because today was bad doesn't mean tomorrow is gonna be worse all right guys just remember that see you later Ooh.